Hi. Hello, hello everybody. Welcome to Neurodivergent Magic, the YouTube channel for accessible and relatable neurodivergent content. We are back, baby. So if you're new here and you didn't realize, I've actually been off of YouTube for about a year and a half. I created really consistently for about a year and it just started to get to be too much for me to handle everything. So I took what was supposed to be a very short break, turned into a rather long break, and a lot has happened in that year and a half that I have been gone. Before we dig into where I've been and what I've been doing, let's clarify a few things because I know my channel is a little confusing about where I stand with my own neurodivergence. So I am autistic and ADHD. I do have professional diagnoses for both. However, this channel is very accepting and welcoming of all self-diagnosed folks, self-identified folks, and people who are maybe just exploring. If you're interested in seeing the process of how I got professionally diagnosed with autism and ADHD, go ahead and check out the video where, wherever it is. So yeah, even though there is a video on my channel saying, so dot dot dot, I'm not autistic. Um, that was a phase I was going through where I was very nervous and dealing with a lot of imposter syndrome around my self-diagnosed autism. And I was like, nope, panic, freak out. I guess I'm not autistic. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> turns out I was very wrong. I went to get diagnosed and uh, the assessor was like, it's pretty clear. And I read through my notes, uh, the report that you get back when you have a professional assessment. Holy cow, this woman read me for filth, you guys. <laughs> So over the last year and a half, I have been learning and coming to terms with these diagnoses. I mean, I was self-diagnosed as autistic before I got my professional diagnosis, and I had kind of suspected ADHD before that as well. Um, but over the last year and a half, I've really been learning so much about what it means to be autistic, what it means to have ADHD, how those two overlap and how they don't. And just so... I don't know, I've, I've just been learning a lot about my brain and about neurodivergence in general, and I love it. In addition to my own personal growth, I've also been doing a lot of business growth. So if you don't know, in addition to being a content creator, I'm also a neurodivergent life coach, and I have several different like programs that people can join to get help from me. So there's the Neuro Spicy Club, for example, which is my monthly membership. And this is a really like community-based program. We have a really active Discord where everybody hangs out. We do weekly body doubling, monthly group coaching with me, monthly guest expert workshops, because I don't know everything there is to know about neurodivergence, so I like to bring in the experts. Uh, and then we also have a monthly book club, which is super fun. We actually read one book every two months because a lot of us struggle with reading, but we meet every month, so we meet twice per book. Then there's also the Neurodivergent Magic program, which I've talked about on this channel before. I love it. It's my signature program. It's all about executive dysfunction and how to get shit done in 24 hours or less. Yes, I'm absolutely and finally, there's also one-on-one -on -one coaching with me, which I don't advertise very often, but I do actually have a couple of spots open right now. So if you're interested in one-on-one -on -one coaching or any of those other options I mentioned, check out the description. So on a personal note, what have I been up to for the last year and a half? Um, well, one really big thing is we moved, as you can tell by this beautifully aesthetic brick wall that is now in every video I'm ever gonna film. We are so happy with our new house. Uh, the old house we were in was wonderful. It was beautiful, but it was very, very small. And this house is literally three times the square footage. You guys, I feel like I can breathe in this house. I can expand, I can move my body without hitting a wall. Another thing that's been going on in my personal life and one of the reasons we decided to move is I had twins. Yes, I, I'm serious. I, I just gave birth to twins like two months ago. And the thing is, it's so crazy. I knew it was twins, like from the get-go. I was like, I, I don't know, I just, this pregnancy already, I was only like five or six weeks. I was like, it's so different than my pregnancy with my firstborn. Like, I just get the feeling that it's twins. And my husband was like, Megan, all pregnancies are different. Like, you just, you never know. Maybe it's just a girl this time instead of a boy and like, whatever. I was like, maybe, but I have the feeling it's twins. So we go to the ultrasound and the tech immediately goes, so there's two. So I was completely right about that. And then I was also like, hey, I think maybe they're girls. 
and then they were girls, identical girls in fact. So they're almost two months old and they are absolutely perfect and wonderful and they're actually sleeping pretty good chunks. They're giving us about five hours at a time, which I will take. And I really wanna list like a third thing. I feel like that'll round out this list. Like, oh, we moved, we had babies and like, I feel like there should be a third thing, but you know what? Moving and having twins is enough, all right? I can't think of a third thing I've done in my personal life in the last year and a half. And I don't know if that's sad or not, but it is what it is. My business and my family are my life, so I don't do a whole lot else. So what is the game plan moving forward with YouTube? So I'm gonna be posting much more consistently and not just every week. That's right, folks. We're doing Vlogmas. I love Vlogmas, okay? I love watching Vlogmas. I've always wanted to do Vlogmas and this year is the year and I am so pumped. The goal of Vlogmas for me is going to be to show you what it's like trying to survive the holidays as an Audi HD mom. How do I juggle family and business and my neurodivergencies and all of the holiday stressors? I wanna take you inside my life and show you how I do it. Well, I think those are the updates and um, I would say I'll see you next Tuesday, but I'll actually see you sooner for day one of Vlogmas. Bye.